my name is Valerie. Today I have an adventure mystery packed book that will get you on the edge of your seat. No joke. Read with Val. Read on, have fun, and dream big. And this book is Allie Cross, Like Father, Like Son, book two. So, this book is by James Patterson, and it is a realistic fiction book slash mystery, more, hmm, more like a adventure slash mystery, and I would rate this book a 10 out of 10. So this is book two. I haven't read book one, but it seems to me that it's fine reading book two instead of book one first, because it's like a different mystery, even though the characters are the same. Our main character is Ali Cross, and he is a kid detective, specifically. He's a friend. He's a son. Um, so he has a pretty normal life as a teenager. But one day, while he and his friends are at, a, like, a concert, um, Ali's friend, Zoe, gets shot in the wrist, and... Um, they have to obviously like go to the hospital and take care of her wrist. Um, but Allie, he sees something and it's this person who has like black boots on and like a big coat, like a brown coat, um, who shot Zoe and Zoe is begging Allie not to tell anyone that he saw like the brown coat and black boots person and that is a really big secret and it's really suspicious because first of all why would Zoe be sort of protecting that person um why like what and if she is protecting that person why would that person shoot her and why would Zoe still protect her? So it's just a, her or him. Sorry, her or him. Because we don't know. So yeah, I mean, it's just very weird. And Allie Cross, being the father, being the son of a detective slash police officer, um, he decides to take the matters and to take this matter into his own hands because he wants to protect Zoe. He wants to get to the bottom of this situation and this mystery. So that is what this book is about. And Ali gets a lot of, well, he gets help from his friends, Gabe, Cedric, Mateo, and also Ruby, and also Zoe and Ali. They're kind of like a group, a friend group. And... Um, yeah, so, um, it's just a very, very interesting story, and I think it'll get you, like, it gets readers thinking about, like, why would Zoe do this, or, like, um, him do that, or whatever, um, it just gets you thinking, and all these, like, questions pop into your head while you're reading it, because, um, you don't know, and you want to find out, so... Read on to find out what happens in the story. So, my favorite character in this book would be Zoe because, like I said, she is, like, the center of this mystery. And, um, like, knowing the place that she is in would be really hard because at the end, when you find out, like, the truth about, like, why... Zoe was protecting that person. She's like in this very complicated situation. So, yes, that's why I like her because um even though she manages to stay cool, calm and collected during this whole situation, she is still the person who got shot. You know, she's still the person in pain and it's kind of it's kind of interesting when you find out the truth. And this book is, like I said, it will keep you on the edge of your, on the edge of your seat, and it will really get you thinking. So yeah, I hope 
Everyone enjoys this book as much as I did. Remember to read on, have fun, and dream big. I'll see you guys later. Bye.